Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trofinet and welcome back to Tales from the Borderlands. Uh, last time we ended episode 3 and today we'll head straight into episode 4, Escape Plan Bravo. Here we go! So last time we got the short angle of the stick in a fight with Brick and Mordecai. Now it seems we're back at the uh, find future. Looks like we're in for some showers. Oh, awesome! Yeah, let's let's do that. Can't wait. Meteor showers. Are you yeah. thinking? It looks like you're you're thinking. That suit he's wearing. It looks familiar, but I hmm, I can't place it. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Neither can I. What the hell is this guy getting out of all this? I can't figure it out. Endless porch down the lane. There's gotta be a reason for it. Evolve. They're What's gonna. Fault? Why else would he be collecting show us pieces? who he actually is? It's just like every shade on Pandora looking to strike it rich. Aren't uh, aren't you kind of you know vault hunting now? Are you calling me an idiot? Yeah, it's what I did there. Yeah. Hmm. I feel like we should do something. If we get to those get hills, along. maybe we could lose it. I don't know. What's he gonna do? Huh? Shoot us both. Don't do anything stupid. I seriously doubt that. Don't be stupid. He has a gun. So? He clearly needs us for something. If he wanted to shoot us, he already would have. I think all those shots to the head are taking their toll. That hasn't helped. Well, I'm for it. And you should too. Remember, no, you shouldn't. Zigzag when you run, okay? It uh, makes you harder to hit. That sounds stupid. I'm not gonna it's run. Not stupid. It's, it's genius. All right. Going on three. One. I'm gonna stay put. Two. Three. Go. Hi, Reese. <laughs> That's well, a weird way to run. He's <laughs> zigzagging. It apparently makes him harder to hit. Of course. <laughs> what the hell was Smack. that? I don't know. Meteor shower. Get to the shelter. Oh god! Oh god! Oh! Good time events already! Jesus. Oh, he's gonna get his ass kicked. <laughs> and there's the duct tape. What's that? Ooh. This again. Oh. I can't trust you two. Wait, I didn't run. I didn't even run. And that's why you're still conscious. So, you just gave away Gordas. She was mm. taken. Not and really. you were stuck under Valerie's gun. It was a rocket launcher, okay? It was massive. Even for her. And we need to get Vaughn? to Helios, that's right. Vaughn! Shut up. Okay. Hey! Smack, Jesus. Not so rough. Thanks, Valerie. I think. Ah, great. Sorry, boss. The nerd is gone. Some old dude with crazy hair ran off with it. That's, That's okay. Good. We've got what's important. Good that we saved him. There, there, little one. The Atlas Empire. No need to be upset. I'll answer your questions. Please, just promise that you won't hurt anyone. Of course, dear. I don't want to hurt anyone that's It'll being It'll be okay, Gordis. Or Gordis. Hey, look at me. It'll be alright. Now, tell me about the Vault of the Traveler. The, the Traveler? The Vault of the Traveler teleports all over the universe, only staying in one spot for a few minutes before blinking away. But once I have my last piece, the beacon that's up on Helios, I can summon the vault and hold it here. Then you collect treasure or something. What does the beacon look like? That's why we I, need him. I don't know. But I'll know it when I see it. That's what happened with the last piece. Well, that's some exciting news. Thank you, gorgeous. You're... you're welcome. Can I get away from you now? 
course. <laughs> so we still need to go to space. Look at you, Fiona. Just so angry. Is this about Athena? I guess. You're feeling guilty. That's what. Leave her alone. You can't blame you yourself. You couldn't fight fair. Made her own bed. You couldn't fight fair, could you? Had to call in some goons to take her on. Goons? I wouldn't call Brick and Mordecai that. They're highly trained vault hunters, and they deserve your respect. True. Now listen up. Under normal circumstances, <clears throat> your rotting corpses would already be getting torn apart by skags right now. But these are not normal circumstances. And with that last piece being on Helios, I can't think of a better crew than a pair of Pandoran con artists and a Hyperion stooge to figure out a way to get it for me. Sounds like a plan. What do you say? On a way to make it. And I'll plan. give you a hint. The only right answer is yes. Please don't buy any of this bullshit, Fiona. This is not a negotiation. What's in it for us? What's in it for us? What's in it for you? Gonna keep well, the con artists for alive. Starters. Uh oh, oh, sorry, Sasha. Like this will stop happening. Does that work for you? Or do you think we should negotiate more? Mm. What's it gonna be, Fiona? Don't give in. I I'm fine. Hey, you said you wouldn't hurt anyone. No, I uh, said I didn't want to hurt anyone. Okay, we gotta go. Cut. That's fucking yeah, bold, okay. but hey. Yes, okay, we'll work for you. But we get a cut. Oh. Mm. That ain't a good idea. You're seriously yeah. asking for a cut while I have a knife in your sister? Clearly, I should phrase that differently. Yeah. We'll discuss terms when you get back. Okay. You didn't have to Sorry, do Sorry, Sasha. Yeah, you shouldn't have given in. What? Shut up. What the hell is wrong with you two? And what We've reason got that? What principles? Son. Ask for money? Yeah. Be a dear and help them come up with a plan. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, ma'am. Let's get cracking. Okay, Nola North. Up in my grill! I'm telling you, it's not possible. We can't do this. That's not an option. Neither is getting ourselves killed. One way or another, we're gonna figure out how to pull this off. Okay, let's start with how we're gonna get there. Well, this isn't the first time we've had to get Everybody creative. Everybody we'll just calm down. Come on, find a come rocket on, booster. Everyone oh, calm I'm loving down, your optimism. Okay? Thank you. All right, guys, it boils down to this. Somehow we've got to get to Helios, infiltrate Hyperion, and steal Gordis's vault beacon. Sorry, that was breakfast. <clears throat> Sorry, what breakfast? without getting ourselves killed. Thank you, Captain Obvious. No shit, moron. I just said that like 30 seconds ago. Everyone knows what we have to do. We're just trying to figure out how to do it. Okay, okay. If you stop being so negative, oh, maybe we there's a buddy. Here, buddy. That'll sword. teach you to hit the I taco do, truck. Right now, I don't see how that's gonna happen. Wow, you we'll got the magic, kid. They should there bottle the so stuff. Let's call it weak sauce. And that's why we have to drill down no, no, I'm sure there's, there's greatness the in there so somewhere. We just fault? just gotta keep I'm looking. The one forcing us to go on a Actually, suicide I could use your help. Yeah, of course you could. Real helpful. Is that a yes that or no? What? Do you think old said. Jack would leave the his meat buddy is, hanging? Don't have a choice. His meat buddy. I honestly don't corner. know how to answer that. You don't think I know so listen, maybe I hate to be the bearer of good news here, but Fiona, there's one Sasha thing you know about in me. The it's is I'm a collector of my rival's that. top secret but project. What's your solution, then? That's why I'm going to share this juicy little tidbit with you. Once upon a time, a few of my guys borrowed an Atlas shipment that contained parts for one of their top secret projects. So, the beacon's up there? Oh. I think I forgot to answer that one. Yeah, what I'm saying is this, I got your beacon somewhere in my office. Get in there, I was trying and to follow this conversation. Baby. I just don't see how we're gonna do this. You don't get that beacon. You're all as good as dead. Thanks. You're not helping. For the optimism. Oh, great. Captain Obvious wants to speak. I may have some info. Uh, I believe I have some information that is relevant to your interests. The beacon is in Handsome Jack's office. 
You pulled that out of your ass. Mm. Well, check it out, out of smart my head, guy. But... Run it by Gordis. Fine. Hey, put the little robot on. Listen, you got access to a map of Helios? I do. See if you can focus your scan for the beacon in Handsome Jack's old office. Wait, what? He can do that? Beacon detected! We got a winner! I'm sending Reed the location data now. Okay. Well, let's see what we have here. Enhance? Oh, so you can say it. <laughs> You're shitting me. I wouldn't know how. Because we're that both sector must shit. be crawling with guards. Hey, give me one reason why you think we could possibly break in. <laughs> Man. Handsome Jack tour. How many people you gotta kill to get an office like that? Billions. A lot and I, I think, think that's the rounding down plan music on Jack's murder case. Going you again. better believe that place. The Jack experience. I hear that you're scared. Hey, I am too, the but IP working tour. together, I think we have a shot. Great. Sign me up. I don't know how we're gonna get through this. Teamwork. That's how. Then you better have a damn good plan. Oh. Well, there Let's we go. Talk. Behold! Helios! Okay. Now how do we get there? Oh, well, Helios is in space, so we need a... spaceship, obviously. Again, well, we don't Nobius. exactly have one lying around. Scooter. What about Scooter? He said we could call him any time. Well, you got yourself a rocket man, miss! Can he make rockets? And then it's off to Helios. We, we, Pandora, we have lift Fun off. Fact. Before we dock, I'll tell a vet we've arrived. She'll help us. Why not call I now? still don't trust the that. The less she knows, the woman. safer she is. Hey, vet, we're back. Awesome, Reese. You're a hero. I'll tell the guards to let you through. Yeah, that's exactly what's going to happen. At ease, soldier. Then I'll disable the security system. You rock! I am a living god. Uh, I don't think it will go the that smoothly. You'll take Sasha and Gordis and go to the hub of heroism. Now, up on Helios, Jack's office is a museum. Hallowed ground. Not even Vasquez had access. Looks like the only sure access is the VIP tour. Meet your new tour guides. Ah, okay. With a giant robot in tow? From there, we'll get into Jack's office. We're all. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, you'll need me for that, obviously. Because of his hair. Or... Once inside, Gordis will ID the piece. Wow! This place is huge! This way, please! And to the victors, okay. the spoils. Told you. <laughs> and that's the end of the episode. Thank you guys Wait, for what you just kidding. How are you going to pull any of this off? Hyperion wants you dead. Then I better go as someone else. What? How is that going to work? Seriously? And for the grand finale... That's a thing. I'll digestruct a vast skies. Since when can they do that? Reese guess. Checks inside Reese. Who's inside Hyperion's Vasquez? Gonna want proof getting that Reese complicated. Is dead. We'll use Vasquez's body. They'll never know the difference. This could yeah, except actually from the robot maybe arm. work. So I guess all that's left is pitching the plan to Valerie. She'll go for it. And getting me to Old Haven. And I'll go to Scooters. Wait a second. Hmm? What? So how did you figure out the pieces in Jack's office? Oh, shite. Don't tell them, princess. They'll sabotage the whole freaking mission. Maybe we should, since it we already... Came out of nowhere. Fallen. Don't do it. Ooh, this is gonna be risky. But hey, risky is my little words. Okay, team. Um, prepare to have your minds blown. <laughs> Handsome Jack is in my head. God, but damn it! Did you just just allow me to explain? Okay. When I plugged Nakayama's ID drive into my head port, I kind of accidentally uploaded an AI version of Jack into my brain. But, but it's cool. It's cool. I've I've got everything under control. <laughs> yeah. What? You had that murdering son of a bitch in your head all this time, and you didn't tell us? You asshole. And we thought August was a prick. <laughs> okay. If Jack's really in there, I want to talk to him. You know, just give him a piece of my mind. Yeah, that's not happening. But he'll only talk to me. Oh, how convenient. 
Well, that went over well. Even your oddly ripped moron sidekick took it better. Anyway, you know how it goes. Snitches get stitches. I just made that up. It's clever. Yep, so when you the best slapped decision. my ass back there, that was Jack? Yep. Sorry. And here I thought of you as a friend. Why, why does that disregard that? I'm not one to say I told you so, but uh, I told you so. Oh, and it'll be good smoother times, in huh? the future, I hope. Have fun cleaning up your mess. I understand how you feel. Because you have every right to be angry, okay? I, I would be too. I should splatter you all over this fan. I should have told you earlier, I get it. That you're Hyperion scum? Let's just say for argument's sake that you didn't mean to be a lying scumbag and that you understand that you should have shared what is an incredibly vital piece of information. Uh... So far, so good, I guess. Even if we could somehow trust you again, how can we trust Jack? No more lies. You need to level with us from here on out. Jack, I really he, he makes me stronger. No, 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 my eye, my arm. He's improved everything. Oh, you're saying he helps you? Kinda. Who helped you? Nobody. All right, Valerie signed up on the plan. Reese is going with Finch and Kroger. Well, the rest of us are off the hollow well. point to get this thing spacey. And Let's get mad. to work. I think that decision is gonna bite me in the ass. August. But hey. Gordis. I'll miss you. We've been Just hurry up. worse, haven't we? I don't like being alone with this thing. <gasps> but I like you so much. <laughs> Hey, have you got a plan for what to say to Scooter? Because he screwed him out of a lot of money for those caravan repairs. Maybe we should be honest to him. I he mean, he's a angry. nice guy. And I've heard stuff about what he did to the Zafford clan. Oh, that wasn't a pretty jolly guy we'll for someone who just buried another man alive. Just be honest. He likes us, and he's a, he's a decent guy. He yeah, likes Sasha. I mean, he'll probably jump at the chance to build something cool, right? Hey, Mike. Ha! As I live and breathe, the fine Fiona, looking as fresh in her new duds as any gentle lady I ever seen. Come to see your old sponsor, huh? Mm -hmm. How go the races? I know you sure like going fast. Ha <laughs> ha! What you lied about the like racing? Sorry, leader. Scooter. Oh, oh, hey. So, uh, mm, we lied about being racers. We were only in that one death rally by accident. We just really needed repairs. Like, life or death stuff. Sorry. Oh no, I am so surprised. Come on, girl, I knew you wasn't racist. <laughs> but you look like <laughs> a couple of good-natured gals, and I never turned down an opportunity to help a couple ladies. Thanks, Scooter. Especially when I got a crush on one of them, and I will not say who that is, no matter what. Fiona, shoot! What? I thought what he had can a I do crush on for? Sasha. Well, no... Not saying I that didn't I have do two bad nothing, decisions in a no, row, so... Well, not that I'm saying I wouldn't great. either. Uh, we'll want you we like are going to make with the words so I can, I can shut mine. Scooter, we are going to space. What? I love space! It's like my fourth favorite thing behind tacos, trucks, and heavy eye contact. Heavy eye that contact? That all sounds great. Only problem is funding. No, don't worry about it. Valerie will pay for whatever we need to get to Helios, get the Gordas piece, and get out. Oh, great. I understood exactly half those words. Let's do it. <laughs> Gotta love Scooter. Oh, wait. When I said that there was only one problem, I meant that there were two. He can't make look, rockets. I know a lot about cars, and I know a lot about engines. Yeah, we have the it. Rockets are right out of my purse. Who's the car man? My business partner knows rockets like you wouldn't believe. Oh. But she's, uh, she's a little James out of Springs. Hi, girl. Tina's girlfriend. So I told you this before. I this don't know is, if she's uh, in much shape one of the first rocks, characters you she's been like that, encounter so when you play heard about a couple ball sequel. hunters nabbed her girlfriend out in the tundra. Athena? Oh, you know Athena? Man, small world. Yeah, we were there when it happened. Fiona was the last one with her. Then I don't know. Maybe you could 
talk to Jenny, let her know what's what. How are, going, her how are we going to explain can. that? We're going to do our best. Nice bike. That's a nice bike. You make that yourself? I did. It was going to be a present for Athena when she got back. Oh, crap. Oh. Yeah. Oh. She lied to me. Said she was on some delivery run. I really wanted to believe her. I did. But she forgot to turn her echo off the last time we spoke. Okay, uh, so she knows. I recognized your voice when you came in. You were out there with her. Her echo went dead after the fighting started. I couldn't... What was she doing? Why did she lie to me? Pick something nice. I need to know. I know she wasn't on a delivery job. She was Why training me. Why would she lie to me like that? Why would she leave? She was training me. For what? To be a vault hunter. She wasn't putting herself in danger for her own sake. She was teaching me how to survive. She wouldn't do something like that out of the goodness of her heart. No. An old friend of ours hired her. Yeah? And where's he? He exploded. Oh, hell. Athena. So what happened to her exactly? I've never seen Athena lose a fight. How'd she get grabbed? Uh, so long as she's got that shield, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on her. Oh yeah, she was saving me. It doesn't make sense. She can't... She threw she her was shield saving at my us. Life. Valerie threw two vault hunters and her entire gang at Athena, but she held them off. She only surrendered to stop them from killing me. Your girlfriend is a hero. Yes, she is. I know. Ha ha ha. This is kind of awkward. Change the subject. These nice ladies want us to build a rocket for them? What do you say? I don't know if I've got the parts. Sure you do. Come on. You just gotta... I just want to know one last thing. And uh -oh. then I'll see about the rocket. Did she... Say anything about me? Before they took her. The way she acted... I'm gonna Sometimes lie I didn't here. Even know if she little liked lie her. for goodwill. Like maybe I was just a fluke or something. She told me to pass on a message. She said she loves you. She did? I. Oh, goodness. Look at that. Okay. She's so happy. Oh, wow. Young lady, you are gonna have yourself a rocket. And once I'm done building it, I'm going to grab every gun I can carry, I'm going to drive out of here, I'm going to rescue my girlfriend, and I'm going to marry the piss out of her. Marry the piss I mean, out of her. Okay. I can probably That's build you something that'll before. break Atmo, but beyond that, you want a mechanic on board to make sure it doesn't explode on you. Scooter's oh, coming along. That sounds like a job for the scooter man if I ever heard one. And considering it's a dream of mine to catch a ride into space and all that, it will be a like space this. mechanic. Wow. Scooter. Wanna come with? Be our onboard mechanic? You mean it? Whoa, space buddies! Oh yeah. Great. Okay. So that's another crew member added to the list. 